so dear students good morning to all today we are going to see the major rivers in maharashtra and the last point of this chapter is waste flowing rivers particularly konkan rivers as you know as you know that we have already seen the waste flowing rivers and particularly we have covered tapi and purna river in the waste flowing rivers but there are most of the rivers which flows from east to west and particularly these rivers are konkan rivers Kokan rivers is nothing but the rivers which rises in the Kokan region and meets to the Arabian Sea. So, which are these Kokan rivers and how they are flowing, which uh, and where they meets, we have to see. So, if we see the Kokan region, we come to know this Kokan region is low lying and very narrow. There is a high cliffs of Sahyadri ranges towards east and Arabian Sea towards west. In between these, there is a Kokan region. The, there are many rivers in this region all the rivers in konkan region are waste flowing the konkan region is narrow towards north to south the width of the konkan region towards north is 100 km while towards south it is 30 km to 40 km it means it indicates that it is a higher uh, higher place or higher region where there is cliffs and valleys and various rivers are there which originate in this particular region and uh, they flows very rapidly and meets to the arabian sea area occupied by river basin is 30394 square kilometer and all the rivers rises in the side ranges and meets to the arabian sea so what exactly the characteristics of konkan rivers are there we have to see the first and foremost characteristic is all the rivers are shorter in length as you know that the width of the konkan region is too much less as compared to the length and that's why whenever they uh, rises or whenever they originate at the peak of the mountain of sayadri ranges they um, they meets to the arabian sea means whatever the distance traveled by their by these rivers is very short and that's why their these rivers are shorter in length second is all the rivers are fast flowing due to steep slope of sayadri ranges as you know that there are cliffs and uh, steep slope of the sayadri ranges whenever these river rises at the mountain or at the tip of the mountain uh, then uh, it uh, flows faster and that's why uh, due to the steep slope their flow of the water is very faster or very uh, speedy speedier and that's why these rivers are uh, fast flowing rivers second uh, next one is erosional work of river is less due to the short length as you know that we have already seen that how the work how the uh, work of river is going on uh, that is in the three uh, steps that is erosional work transportational work and depositional work but erosional work of the river is less due to the short length particularly in the konkan region because <coughs> as you know that whenever there is a, a huge length or the more length then there is a possibility of the erosion and there is a chances to get erode the erode the region or the rocks or the or re relief by the rivers or by the water means there is a chances to cut down the uh, relief or the rocks or the physiography but due to the short Uh, distance or due to the short length erosional work of these rivers is too much less as compared to the uh, river another rivers next one is uh, by mistake it is 3 it actually it is 4 waitarna and ullas rivers have more than 100 km length and others are less than 100 km length only waitarna and ullas river have 100 km distance more than 100 km distance but most of the rivers have Uh, less length or uh, below to the 100 km there are main 11 rivers in konkan region which are those we have to see so these are the major characteristics of konkan rivers and these are very simple and easy to understand so which major rivers uh, from north to south are there in the konkan region we have to see the first river is waitarna we have already explained uh, that about the its length ullas river is of 1 445 km 
पाताल गंगा इज ऑफ फोर्टी फाइव किलोमीटर अंबा इज ऑफ सेवेंटी फाइव किलोमीटर कुंडलिका रिवर हैव सिक्सटी फाइव किलोमीटर लेंथ सावित्री हैव थर्टी एट किलोमीटर लेंथ वशिष्टी रिवर हैव सिक्सटी एट किलोमीटर लेंथ शास्त्री रिवर हैव सिक्सटी फोर किलोमीटर ऑफ लेंथ मुचकुंडी एटी किलोमीटर अचरा फोर्टी एट किलोमीटर एंड तेरेखोल रिवर हैव नाइन्टी एट किलोमीटर लेंथ सो इफ वी ट्रैवल फ्रॉम नॉर्थ टू साउथ मीन्स फ्रॉम थाने रायगढ़ रत्नागिरी एंड सिंधुदुर्ग वी रियलाइज और वी कम एक्रॉस विद दीज रिवर्स अकॉर्डिंग टू द अकॉर्डिंग टू द नॉर्थ एंड साउथ सो दीज एलेवन रिवर्स आर वेरी वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट सो फॉर कोकन रिवर्स आर कंसर्न एंड पर्टिकुलरली वेस्टर्न रिवर्स आर कंसर्न सो इफ वी पुट दीज रिवर्स अकॉर्डिंग टू देयर लेंथ देन वी कम टू नो विच रिवर इज द लॉन्गेस्ट एंड विच रिवर इज द शॉर्टेस्ट उल्लास रिवर इज लॉन्गेस्ट रिवर इन द कोकन रीजन दैट इज दैट हैव और दिस हैव वन वन हंड्रेड एंड फोर्टी फाइव किलोमीटर वैतरना हैव वन हंड्रेड एंड ट्वेंटी फोर किलोमीटर दिस इज द सेकेंड लॉन्गेस्ट रिवर इन द कोकन रीजन तेरेखोल हैव नाइन्टी एट Muchkonde have 80 km length, Amba 74, Vaishisti 68, Kundalika 65, Shastri 64, Achara 48, and Patal Ganga 45 km. And the last, which is the Savitri River, which flows only 38 km of distance, and uh, it indicates that uh, from north to south, as you know that uh, from north to south the width get decreased, and that's why. Uh, most of the rivers which are longer they are originated originate in the northern part and the river which have a shorter they are originate or they, their origin is in the uh, south region or south part of the kokan region so if we come to uh, if we uh, see the sequence of rivers according to district north to south then we realize that how many rivers are there in each and every kokan district or kokan region palgar thane mumbai raigad ratnagiri and sindhudurg districts are there in the kokan region in the palgar district tamanganga surya pinjal vaitarna and tansa rivers uh, are there in thane bhadsa kalu murbadi and ullas river is there In Mumbai, particularly in the metropolitan city, that is Daisar, Oshiwara, Boysor, and Mithi River is there. This is uh, well known for its uh, flood, uh, flood, uh, particularly in the uh, rainy season, where whenever it get flooded, there is a problem of traffic and uh, traffic congestion. रायगर इज द डिस्ट्रिक्ट वेयर उल्लास पाताल गंगा भोगावती अंबा कुंडलिका काल घोड़ गंधार एंड सावित्री रिवर्स आर देयर इन द रत्नागिरी रिवर भाजरा भारजा जोग जगबुड़ी वैशिष्टी शास्त्री बाव काजड़ी मुचकुंडी काजवी एंड शक रिवर्स आर देयर इन द सिंधुदुर्ग डिस्ट्रिक्ट देवगढ़ आचरा गढ़ कार्ली एंड तेरेखोल रिवर्स आर देयर so according to the district and particularly north to south there is the distribution of these rivers and there is a uh, particularly catchment areas of the particular rivers so if we uh, see the dams in the kokan region which dams are there uh, on which river we come to know that on the vaitarna river there is a modak sagar dam on the bhatsai river there is a bhatsa dam there is a tansa river where tansa dam is there the name itself given by that river surya same way surya river is there surya dam is uh, constructed on the on this river patal ganga mokha dam is there uh, kundalika river dolawahal dam is there and murbadi river which have a bara barwai dam on the murbadi river so these are the major rivers and these they thus there is a distribution of particular rivers in a kokan region so this is all about the kokan rivers now today we stop here thank you thank you very much